Hi, I'm Mandy, and welcome to Sumptuous Living, where I share really amazing recipes, kind of simple cocktails, and some fantastic design ideas. And I'm really excited to share today on our first ever YouTube video, our most favorite and most pinned triple chocolate Kahlua cake. It's actually called Mandy's Triple Chocolate Kahlua Cake, because I made it up. So, it is a doctored cake box recipe, and who doesn't want an extra trick in your kitchen to make things go quicker, especially with the holidays or throwing a big party. This little nugget of throwing a cake box into the mix lets you get things done so much faster. Plus, it's so delicious. This recipe has three different types of chocolate in the actual chocolate cake mix. Then we take a gorgeous Kahlua glaze and put it on top, and then we top it again with ganache. So it sounds like there's a lot of steps, but it's super simple and you can get it done in just minutes. And like I said, it has been a hugely popular recipe on Pinterest, bananas. So let's get started. Okay, so we're gonna start with a box cake mix, just your favorite chocolate boxed cake mix goes into a mixing bowl. And it doesn't matter what brand, whatever your brand of favorite, you know, chocolate kind of cake mix that you like. And then chocolate pudding. And the pudding actually keeps the cake super moist. It, um, I make also a rum cake mix that uses a vanilla cake mix and vanilla pudding. And it just makes almost like a pound cake type of a recipe. So to that, we're also gonna add chocolate syrup. It's a quarter cup of chocolate syrup. And I am a true believer that chocolate is only done with dark chocolate. I am not a milk chocolate girl. If I wanted sugar to muck up my chocolate, I would buy sugar, but I want chocolate. So this is actually dark chocolate syrup, because that's how I roll. We also have chocolate chips. Semi-sweet is perfect. And then that way it doesn't, um, it's not also really, really sweet that way. And then we have eggs go in. You don't even, everything just goes into the bowl. You don't even have to like do a lot of pre-work and then also we have Kahlua and water and oil. And Kahlua has that amazing chocolate and coffee kind of mixture flavor together, so it goes brilliantly with chocolate. Ooh. So next we're gonna mix it all up. All goes into one bowl. There's no med mega mixer that you have to do. You don't have to have um, any kind of special equipment. I use a whisk just to make sure I get all the bits up, but it will be a lumpy cake batter and that is fine of course because we've got chocolate chips in there so now we're gonna go ahead and make sure we get all the batter into a pan that I have already floured with cocoa powder after I sprayed it with nonstick cooking spray I love a bump pan I just think it slices so pretty and I'm also not one who wants to do with a lot of um, cake decorating and frosting and fancy fanfare. I want my oven to do my job for me. I want the um, the pan itself to do my job for me. I'm kind of a little lazy that way. So this goes in the oven. It's gonna cook for about an hour. And then when it comes out, we're gonna make our glaze and we're gonna make our ganache to make it perfect. So our amazing triple chocolate Kahlua cake is all done baking in the oven. I checked it with a toothpick and just checked it in the center to make sure that it came out nice and clean and it did. So now let's move over to the cooktop and make the glaze with the coffee and the sugar and the butter and the Kahlua that is then gonna get poured all onto this cake and soak in like the most amazing little sponge of mmm that you're ever gonna taste. So I have a small little saucepan on medium on my cooktop and I'm gonna add some butter to it. That's gonna get all nice and melted. And to that, I'm gonna add sugar. Just white sugar is fine. Along with, let your nose tell you what your brown liquids are or something that looks like something else in your pan. I've got Kahlua going in and then coffee. I always have extra coffee. I'm a hit me hard, hit me strong, kind of just jolt it straight into my vein, if you can, uh, kind of a girl. So there's always strong coffee in my house. I'm gonna turn that up and let that bubble away in order to dissolve all the sugar and get it 
completely combined and hot and bubbly, almost syrupy. The sauce, the lovely glaze that were made has bubble, bubble, bubbled, and keep an eye on it because it can boil over. But now that it has come to a nice rolling boil, we are gonna take it over to our cake and pour it in. You still hear the sizzle happening from the edge, and you're just gonna slowly go around the cake. Take your time and let it sink in and soak up all the yummy glaze. So now we're gonna make the ganache for our amazing chocolate Kahlua cake. And I love a little whisk because it helps get the chocolate all nice and melty. And we're gonna add in our cream too. And as the cream heats up, this is heavy cream. There's no milk, there's no half and half, and there's no way to cheat and skinny your way around a ganache. A ganache is with heavy cream and chocolate. And that is the way to do it. So we're gonna go ahead and let that get all melty and gooey. And as it heats up, we're going to be able to stir it together and it will turn into really pretty chocolate. Our chocolate is nice and melty. And now you're starting to see how we're getting this beautiful, glossy chocolate heaven happening in our bowl. You wanna keep mixing it. Oh, see, we just shifted. Do you see how glossy and gorgeous that became? So now we're done. Now we're ready to go ahead. That's a ganache. So. I have this gorgeous chocolate, see? Beautiful ribbons. And we are going to drizzle that all over our gorgeous cake. And typically you would let this set up a little bit so that then the chocolate isn't so gooey. But of course, um, heck am I gonna wait that long? So I've grabbed a plate and a cake carver because I can't wait. Look, it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, gorgeous, gorgeous. And I'm gonna have a bite, but by the time I have a bite after this, there's not gonna be any talking because there's gonna be nothing but chocolate heaven happening in my mouth. So I wanna say thank you and happy holidays to everybody. Or if you're joining us throughout the rest of the year, I hope you adore this cake because it is the best for any birthday, any swanky dinner party or non-swanky dinner party, it's so easy. So have fun, make sure to um, check out this recipe because it is our most pinned and most amazing Mandy's Triple Chocolate Kahlua Cake. Bye everybody, thanks. Mm. Oh my God, it's so good. Mm. What's not to like? Oh my God. I have chocolate goodness of yum. Mm. Mm.